Hello, people. We haven't been keeping up on this, so I say better give up hope, but we're gonna keep watching as much horror movies as we can. I'm gonna say what we're gonna do then. I'm gonna see if we can w watch 31. Even if we don't make it before October, let's at least do this before. Is that Miranda Sings? Yes. Okay, uh, I, we at least, I at least want to actually do 31 horror movies. Anyways, we just got finished watching Rocky Horror Picture Show. And good goddamn, that was weirder than I expected it to be. <laughs> the only reason I knew anything about this movie was because of that one Glee episode where they did Rocky Horror. I did not expect it to be this weird. It was very strange, very convoluted, and very... What the fuck? But, okay, I'll talk, I'll talk more later. Amy, you take over. You want? I'm gonna look for something else on Netflix. Give me the remote. All right, hold on. What's the thing to do with rock? So we just finished watching Rocky Horror, as my brother just stated. I don't know what the hell I just watched. The soundtrack is amazing. I am gonna say that it's awesome. The catchy songs. I almost cried when Time Warp came on. I, the plot. It wasn't hard to follow. It was just really out there. Like, they're aliens and they're not aliens. And towards the end, I didn't even realize what uh, Frankenfurter's a whole role was in the entire plot. Like, what mission did he fill? What was he supposed to do? And then, why is it called Rocky Horror when Rocky Horror is only in, like, three scenes in the movie? And then Eddie just shows up to get killed after his song. And I don't know if they ever found the people or not. And then they take the house back to transsexual. Back to transsexual Transylvania. So, I don't know what the hell happened. I don't know how to rate this movie. I don't know what the fuck to do. But I must say, uh, the makeup, for considering it was then... It's actually pretty nice. I really like Tim Curry's acting. He was so good. Susan Sarandon, my God, and she can really pull it together. And let's see. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, other than that, I didn't get a single thing that happened. I'm going to give this movie a 7 out of 10 just because I didn't get what was going on. Or maybe I just wasn't supposed to understand it, but it was pretty entertaining. Like, there are movies that I've seen that I get and understand everything, and I'm like, that was so fucking boring. No, but this, considering the fact that I don't know what the hell I just watched, it was pretty entertaining. That's all I'm going to say. It's entertaining. So it gets a 7 out of 10, uh, because the plot towards the end, I kind of just lost it. But definitely would watch it again because of the soundtrack. I love the soundtrack. From Transsexual Transylvania. I like that song. That was my favorite song. And obviously Time Warp. Uh, I'm going home was really cool also and creature of the night. Touch a touch me, yeah. Touch a touch me. And yeah, that was that was cool. So I'm gonna pass this over to Ryan so I can give you the three criteria. And I think that's it for me. Like I said. Weird ass movie, pretty entertaining. I understand why it gained the cold following that it that it got. Also Tim Curry, holy shit. He can he can act. He's a chameleon. He goes from playing a freaky creepy ass clown to playing a concierge at a, a New York hotel to playing um Frankenfurter. Not necessarily in that order. But yeah. He's also the butler in clue. Oh and he's also watch that one he's too. also the butler in clue, so yeah. Better watch that movie. I'm gonna pass this over to Ryan so he can take it from here. So bye. Bonjour. Should I the Okay, let's watch this. Okay, you search it, because I'm stuck. So, three criteria, hunty. Badassery, sass, and feels. Let's start with badassery. I love mm, the Considering this, this was a, what do you call it, a musical, so there's not too much badassery. Once like badass in, in a different kind of sense, I would say Frankenfurter is pretty badass, because he's awesome, he's weird, he's freaky, he's fabulous, he's fierce. And also Rocky, yeah, I really like Rocky. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, no, That's a riff raff. He was weird, but he's cool. Yeah, no, 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 no. See, sass. Yes, sass. Frank and Fred, I love it. See, I don't like a man with muscles. I didn't make him for you. Yeah, like, okay, Rocky. <laughs> I really like it. Frank and Fred is really is a sassy bitch. I love it. Feels. Not really too much feels of much sense. 
I don't really get that much feel watching this movie, but it's still a good movie. Now, let me tell you about it a little more. Weird ass movie, as I had said, as I said previously. It is very strange. The story, I had wiki this movie a long time ago, and I was like, okay. And then it's enough, it's like, it's strange. Very, he, he very strange. He screamed out loud when he saw the horror picture show logo, the picture. Yeah. I, like, oh my god, oh my god. And I almost screamed when time went Yes, we love it. We love this song because of Just Dance 4. It's awesome. Uh, what am I saying? Very strange movie. I love the music. The only reason I know this is because they did uh, Rocky Horror on Glee. And I love the music. Time Warp and Sweet Chance Best Side. And also, Touch It Touch Me. I want to drag to that song. And I need to do a Frankenfurter look because I have not done a Frankenfurter look. I would love to do drag a Frankenfurter. And also, what's her name? Columbia and Magenta. Oh. And I want to do drag to Touch It Touch Me. No, yes. So, let me recap this. The movie is strange. It has awesome music. The makeup is pretty cool. I love uh, Tim Curry's contour, Tim Curry's makeup, his eyeshadow. I love the lipstick. I need that lipstick, that whatever they use. I'm going to look for that fucking MAC collection. And I'm going to, an overall rating, I'm going to give it a... I'm going to just give it a 9. Because it was weird. And at some point it wasn't like the good weird. It was just the weird weird. It was weird weird? Yes, yeah, weird weird. Okay, I need to put Rocky Horror says he, from Just Dance, the time warp. And it just took off from there. I had no idea Glee did this. <laughs> yes, I discovered this because of Glee. And yeah, it's a weird movie. It's no. definitely fun. Definitely watch it. Although it's not a family movie. Do not watch this with kids or your parents or something. It's very fun. It's perfect. It's not terrifying, it's not, well, it's kind of stupid, but it's very fun, and because it's spooky season, you should watch it, because it's the Rocky Horror Picture Show. So, I guess it's it for this overview, so, bye!